Fuck it. Puts up a three. Yes. Three. Doing pretty well. Oh, I could be doing better. He's been something, has he? Really competing well out there. Oh, I let Ellis get by. So you get a momentum that builds up to a B. I get it. And every time you do something wrong. Here's Quinn. 17 points in the game. The dish to Oladipo. Oladipo! Yes! And the word coming is this guy can flat out score. Well, he's shown just that. Yeah, he's been raining them threes. The Stars trail by seven. Ellis kicks to left. Oop, no, oh, they're still on him. Yeah, he got it. See, those things aren't my fault. I have to stick to a man. Nah. From three-point range. Now McLemore, he's got eight. Ooh, Noel again. How many fouls you got, buddy? Let's look at some numbers in this one. Still only five points ahead. He's got eight points, and he's done a little bit of work behind the arc. He's got a pair of three pointers. Well, the defenders have that in the back of their minds now, too, so they're going to close out on him quicker. That should allow him to use the drive if he wants. The first free throw is good, and a new group getting ready now for the Stars. Oh, I'm, I'm off again. Ooh, we're only winning by two, man. Here's Bennett. Feeds to Carter Williams. Oh! Tremendous stuff from a guy Clark. We think more. Tried to catch up. We're tied, man. I gotta shoot some trees. A surplus supply too. Well, that's a great aggressive move and two big points too. Oh, come on. Carter Williams is out there with McCollum. Then there's Len. Then there's Bennett. And it's Muhammad in at the three spot. There was just enough defensive pressure to get him off balance and cause that shot to go awry. There's a good screen. Here's Quinn. Yes. Three. Quinn's got nine points now in just the second half. Just the second half. Come on, C. Williams. Behind the arc. Hey, trust me on this one, partner. They are going to continue to let him uh, so one's good in the elite lead is It's a lot of back and forth basketball. What's going on defensively? There a lack of focus, no concentration. Too easy. Here's Quinn. A uh, off the mark. That's some more rugged play from them inside. They have a decent edge in rebounds thus far. And that hard work on the boards needs to continue. Oh, I'm at the wrong guy. Swings this game eventually. Now here's Muhammad. Here's Pennant. Up and in on the way. Oh no, they're winning. Out of UNLV, you love his great hands. I gave that one up. Big guy can really catch and finish at the rim. You start talking about his strength, his ability to absorb contact. I like his game. Steve, the point you make about the hands is really a good. One. Great hands. Oh come on. Good hands become better. Try it again. I got a pass. I'm just like, I mean, greedy. You've got a lot to work with. Now, Muhammad, after the miss three from Quinn. Land, he's covered by Noel. Pass to McCollum. He kicks it to Land. Shot clock at six. The Stars need to get off a shot. Muhammad, no luck. The elite's trailing. Now the feed to Noel. That was a good pass. Kicks it to Quinn. Three-pointer. God. Come on. 
not sure if he just ran out of gas or what, Kevin, but... I'm not sure how to make the best pointer. Ever since the second half started, it's not even been a factor. Now here's Carter Williams. I got to work on a lot of stuff. And once again off the mark by the Stars. Poor shooting performance for him today, but luckily for them, a lot of his team... Oh, Zeller! Yes! Look at that. I think we might be seeing which team is ready to take control of this game. Yeah, that's a dunk that could absolutely get the Oh, he got by me. Ooh. That's two ahead, man. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris? Hey, Kevin. During that last break, I heard the elite's coach as he addressed Come on, his team. Come on, Nate. He was not at all satisfied. Don't let Jackson Ellis dictate things out there. I want to see you outscore him. Okay. And all the 50-50 balls. We simply can't win that way. We've got to get after it. Let's see how they respond, Kevin. Thanks, Doris. Here's Quinn. Damn it. Another miss by the elites. He can't get anything to drop. And the way he's going, I'm not sure it's something he should try to shoot his way out of. No, that might only serve to make things worse, Steve. Sometimes the hard. How the hell am I supposed to block this bastard? Shot misses. Nice D from Zeller. Yo. It's the elites with the ball. A two-point game. And Oladipo kicks to Quinn. He tries Not gonna hit it. No way. You can tell. McLemore's got seven rebounds in the game. Ellis dishes to Muhammad. I stuff? No. Fuck. Ellis has got five assists Dude, in the I'm game. failing so Four bad. Their last five makes came off of a high quality shot inside. Yeah, that's textbook basketball. Just having their way down low. Here's Quinn. Well, oh. the triple. I gotta this go for some twos. A quarter for him to remember. Yeah, sure has it, Steve. I mean, he's been doing his invisible man impersonation here, hasn't he? What the? What is going on? He's been anything but his usual self this quarter. It's actually been ugly to see. Oladipo, the pass to Quinn. From deep. I can't hit nothing. Well, can't hit nothing. To come back here, but you got to get a better look at the basket to get Yes. And Oladipo kicks to Noel. Nice. Block leading to a score. I like that. And 12 rebounds. Beautiful work in the transition. They're game. still winning though. There's only two Back minutes left. Before the defense can get itself set. And I think Doris Burke has something for us right now. Doris? Well, over the break, I listened in on what the head coach for the stars. Shit, what am I allowing? Oh my god, we're gonna lose, man. He'd like the tempo of this game to be taken down a few notches. It's pretty late in the game to be altering the game plan, but they're going to Yes, there's a three. I gotta do more of those. The stars with the lead. Oh my god, he got by me. Back to Ellis. Poke loose. Oh, I poked it. Ooh. Go, buddy. Oh, oh, good save. Oh no! Nice stuff. I gotta get on my man. What am I doing? He feeds it to Bennett. Pass to Lynn. Just five on the clock. McLemore, Ellis outside. The fade away. Nope. That doesn't go either for Ellis. They did have a three point in the first half, but so far here in the second, he's come up empty. Yeah! Three points bringing us ahead. Minute left. Woo! 26 points. Oh, yeah. Yeah, call a timeout. I got to play smart. Enough of this bullshit. No. Oh, my God. This is close. Tied game, man. 54 seconds left. Let's play smart. I'm not going to be selfish. Oh, backcourt shit. Oh. That was stupid. That was dumb of me. I just gave up a potential. Oh, unbelievable. I gotta make the steal. There's 48 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Reaching foul. Oh no. I'm fouling too much, man. And the 
Bears have possession. Ellis outside. Muhammad. Sinks it. That's Shit. a huge shot. And then put a hush over the crowd. Yeah, the volume's been turned down in this building. Okay, it's up to me. I got to get three. Mark a big time possession here. Tell you what, their hearts. It's not just up to me. There's other. I have options. Here's Quinn. The three won't fall. Now here's Muhammad. Oh, no. I think we'll see them burn the clock a bit here. You know, I think oh, geez. Zeller. Dude, they've got the points. Oh, I've, I think I've lost the game. Oh, we missed. Dude, this is what it comes down to. He's got a miss. And I got to get a three. Come on, miss, 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 miss. Shit. No, wait a minute. We'll tie it. We'll tie it if we get a three. Oh, my God. Yes, there's the three. Tied at 82 with 10 seconds left. We got to block this next play, man. We have to. If I didn't let him score that, if he missed that, that would have been the game winner. Or I'd be up a point. Ooh. Oh, shit. No. Oh, no. Oh, my God. A three has to be done. This is even worse. This is even more close. Oh, man. For three! No! 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 That was it, man. That was it. I had my chance. And I fucked it up. God. Now, you know what? I blame myself for a lot of shit in that game. Damn. We'll see what happens, I guess. I got the one dynamic goal. I didn't get any win bonus. That sucks, man. We'll see what happens. He's going to be all up in that. I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe I got more points than he did. Shit. <laughs> yeah, man. Yo, just want to let you know that that was a good game, dog. Even though I took care of business like I said I would. Yeah, you definitely came out to play tonight. Yeah, I think we both left it out on the court, though. Hopefully the scouts noticed. Dude, I came to put on a show. And that's exactly what happened. Whole world got to see what J.E. can do, baby. <laughs> Too bad it came at your expense, though. Yo, man, I ain't worried about it. I held my own out there. Look, the scouts focus on more than just this one game. Hey, hey, at least we know I got you beat in the intangibles department, bro. <laughs> I think I outscored him. Whatever helps you sleep at night, you know what I'm saying? Because check it out. Yeah. I'm about to take the NBA by storm, kid. Mm -hmm. At least you could tell your grandkids that you were the uh, stepping stone on my way to greatness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, looks like the little man's here. I'll leave you to it. God, I put subtitles kid, on, man. man. I did. Seems like this a situation ain't going away anytime soon. Yeah, don't sweat that, dude, man. Look, like you always tell me, right now, it's got to focus on my career. Wow, finally some wisdom is starting to stick. You know what I'm saying, <laughs> baby? Hey, look, man, I've been trying to get info from, you know, the scouts that were here today, right? Look, man, tonight could have went better, but seems like they're going to evaluate more than just this game, all right? Including those intangibles, all right. all right? So even though Ellis might still be ahead of you on most of their boards, you still got a pretty good shot of being a first-round pick in the NBA. Woo! That's what I'm talking about, baby. Look, man. I'm just glad to have this game behind me. All this pressure building up to it. Look, man, I'm ready to move on to the next phase. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, speaking of that, we got plenty to do to get ready for this NBA draft, all right? Yeah. Let's go get dressed, man. All right? We'll talk later. Let's do this, baby all boy. Right. Fuck. I wish I'd won. Before we get started on this pre-draft interview tour, all right, we got a few things to go over. 
first, the NBA sent over this personality test for you to fill out so they can get an idea of how you think, what kind of person you are. A test, man? Come on, really? <laughs> All right. All right, man. Before that, though, let's talk about expectations. How you expect your NBA career to unfold? All right, we got to make sure we always on the same page when it comes to goals and expectations. Okay. All right, let's start with the where. If you had your choice to play for any NBA team, who would it be? Hmm. Well, it shows you. <clears throat> I do like the Bulls. I, I do like the Celtics. But you also got to look at how good they are. The Clippers aren't doing bad. Because you want a team with really good defense. Like the Heat. Look at the Heat, man. They're so good. But I wouldn't get on the Heat. I doubt it. The Lakers are sucking, for sure. That's what I figured. They're really doing poor. The Brooklyn Nets aren't doing that bad. Yeah, see, the Raptors aren't doing terrible. Play for the Raptors. Houston's doing quite good. Golden State, they're not bad. I think it's based on setting the bar. You know what I mean? Because, like, I could say, oh, I want the Bulls. The Bulls are quite good, man, actually. I could also say I want the Heat, which is pretty ridiculous. Offense is 89, defense is 88. The Bulls are doing quite well. Their offense is kind of shitty. How about the Raptors? What are the Raptors doing? 69 offense, 69 defense. Ooh. I don't like that. You know, I might say the Bulls. <laughs> yeah, that's the one, baby. You know it. <laughs> yeah, man. I figured you might say that. But, you know, as your agent, I can't be assuming stuff. This will help me, though, when I'm behind the scenes working on stuff. Okay, okay. So, what is the one thing that's most important to you in your NBA career? Um, let's see, when it all costs, see, you can th earn a lot of money and be an asshole. You'd be a great teammate. Make the hall of fame. You know, we'll win at all costs. That sounds like your focus. Yeah, man. What's up? We done? Yeah, man. We're done. I lined up a few interviews with some teams that were really showing interest in you. All right. All right? But before they talk to you in person. They want to get a feel of what your personality is like. So that's what that personality test is for. All right. So let's take care of that and then we can head out. Let's do it. All right. Okay. Do you feel like the ball should be in your, in your hands for the last shot of the game? Fuck yeah. Do you feel it is your responsibility to keep your teammates playing at a high level? Yes. Which of the following is more important to you as a basketball player? Scoring, defense, uh, scoring for sure. Do you prefer for players to call plays from the floor or look to the coach for help? I'd say player calls plays. Are you comfortable adapting your role to whatever is best for them, for the team? Yes. Yes. Pre oh, the, the Bucks want me. The hey, Milwaukee how's Bucks. it going? Good game tonight. I'm the scouting director for the Bucks. We currently have the 15th pick in the draft and are narrowing down our list of draft targets. If you wouldn't mind, I'd like to ask you a couple questions. As you know, we already have Brandon Knight in our backcourt, but we're really interested in finding a point guard with your skills that would allow him to play off the ball more at the two. How do you see that relationship working? So, you know, we already have Brandon Knight in our backcourt, but we're really interested in finding a point guard with your skills that would allow him to play off the ball more at the two. Uh Oh, I don't even know what to say. Hmm. I could say it worked well. Uh, I think it could work well. If you can have two players out there capable of handling the ball, that just helps the offense run even more smoothly. I'm willing to play off ball on occasion too if B Knight feels like running things. The more I think about it, 
Yeah, this is a situation I could definitely get behind. Definitely. Okay, last question. As a younger team, I feel like we have a lot of opportunities for you. I'm here to tell you that you have a chance to be our franchise centerpiece if you put in the work. How many other teams can offer you that? And are you willing to be patient as this team grows? I don't want to be with the Bucks, though. That's the problem. I'm going to say yes, but it'll be tough. I've never really lost in my entire life. I've always been good enough to propel every team I've ever been on to success. I realize the NBA will be different in that regard, at least at the start of my career. This will really test my patience, but as a man, I'm up for the challenge. Great answers. I really think you'd fit in great with us. Here's hoping we're able to draft you with our pick. Ooh, the Cavs. Although they lost. <laughs> Hello, and nice to meet you. I'm the director of player personnel for the Cavaliers. We're looking to use one of our upcoming draft picks for someone who can help our franchise take the next step. I think you might be that guy. I'd like to ask you a couple questions to make sure. Here we go. Point guard is really the one position this team is solid in. We believe in Kyrie, and we're not looking to draft a player to challenge him for the starting role. Fuck if that. If we were to draft you, we wouldn't want you to feel like we were grooming you to be a career backup. We love your talent. One thought is to try and convert you to a shooting guard such as that you can play alongside Kyrie. What do you think about that idea? Being a, being a shooting guard? For the Cavs. I mean, I shoot a lot. <sighs> hold on. I don't know what to choose. Okay, hold on. Because I've been shooting a lot. I've been shooting them trays. Um, maybe, I might do point guard, because I, I'm just looking at the definitions, I know that's pretty sad, um, you know what, I think I could definitely do that. Hey, if you guys end up drafting me and that's what the team needs, then I'm more than willing to do anything to help this team. My goal has always been to play in the NBA. I know I'm not going to walk onto a team of this quality and demand the ball every time down the court. I'm willing to put in my time, learn a new position, and ultimately, I know I'll be a better player because of it. Next question. This is a question we ask all our potential draftees, and I want you <clears throat> to answer it as honestly as possible. Where do you see your career going? What do you hope to achieve out of your career? Ultimately, what do you want your legacy to be? I want to be the best I can be. Wow. Okay. So I want my career to go wherever it takes me, as cliche as that sounds. Ultimately, I want to be the best basketball player and best team player I can be. At the end of the day, that's really all I can ever ask out of myself. I want to be remembered as someone who gave 110% every time he set foot on the court. Okay, I think I've heard all I needed to hear for now. You're definitely someone we can use on our team. Now we just need you to be available when it's our turn to pick. So these are, these are choices. Man, you ready to talk seriously for a few minutes? I think I might change yeah, to man, a shooting I guard. I you didn't just come over here to hang out like we used to back in the I've day. I've been getting more yeah, points. not entirely, man. I mean, hey. I'll teach you a little lesson in some NBA 2K later. <laughs> you know, again. <laughs> Whatever, young. Yeah, we definitely gonna have to get a game in, but hey, let's get that business out of the way first, all right? All right, man, look. I know that you've been asked to do a lot to get ready for this draft. Heck yeah. I mean, besides the showcase, you got workouts and camps and interviews, and you handling it all like a champ, man. It's just one last piece we gotta sort out. What? Ah, come on. What is it, another private workout or something? With the Cavs? Nah, 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 Wizards, nah, nah. We, we done with workouts, Rockets, man. It's maybe? nothing like that. Hey, look. We gotta get you a suit. 
<laughs> a suit? Yeah. All right, I can live with that, man. Good, Go good, because you know how this draft is, man. I mean, everybody's going to be watching you, so you got to make a splash. Ooh. Uh, you seen how players in the past went all out? Yeah, man. Noah? Yo, Harden? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Man, no one's forgetting that anytime soon. But hey, I can handle it. You know I look fly in whatever I wear, baby. Mm hmm Uh, that's up for debate. I got two words for you. Junior prom. What? Yo, I was styling back then, dog. Uh, yeah, right. Styling. <laughs> Come <laughs> on, son. Oh, my son? God. Son? <laughs> so what's up? What we got to do? Hey, man, look, don't even worry about it. I'm going to front you some cash so you can get something that works. All right. But if you can, you should consider kicking in a little extra just to make sure you really stand out. But that's on you, though. All right, I'm going to think about that. But hey, let's really get down to business. All right. NBA 2K, baby. Oh, come on now. Yeah, I'm going to whoop you, son. Uh, yeah, right. That'll be the first. <laughs> Don't be cheating, either. Jeez. So I wonder if I get to pick. Because I think I might, I, I might go with the Cavs, believe it or not. You all right, man? Just relax a little bit. Because I've been getting more be points. One of those dudes just sits here forever waiting to get picked, man. Hey, man, look. I talk to everybody I can. Everybody agrees you're a lock for the first round, all right? It's going to be one of those moments you remember forever, all right? So just relax, man. Enjoy it. Yo, it's just that... Talk to me. It's just... I'm about to find out which team I start my NBA career with, man. I'm about to find out what city I spend the next 